Wow. Well, that we're in. Uh, we're here. Yeah, yeah, we're yeah. back. We're back. We're, we're back. back at it again. The Swag Life series, fall 2023. We said summer was coming up. And you know, summer, summer came is, and went. Summer, yeah, summer happened. Summer came and went, but the fall is where it's at. We love the yeah. transition seasons around here, you know. Yes, we do. Equinox, not too far away. And the best way to celebrate that is with some SLS action. Mm -hmm. And some of you got to witness the blue moon that happened oh this year. God. Yeah, that was that incredible. Was, I love that going was to that crazy. Inn. Whenever in Varrock, it's in that end. Oh, my God. It was uh, for Vampire's Quest. I mean, dude, well. five gold for a beer. Let's go. That's not I, bad. I, I used to train attack because you can't You're kill the point. vampire unless you have the stake. Exactly. So you just sit there and just uh, kill them all day. One all day. Uh, life hack for anybody out there who plays old school room. That is true. If they're that not, is. they should. But anyway, but, so yeah, I mean, yes. this is yeah, night yeah, one, yeah, guys. Yeah. Of the what are we here for again? I just yeah, can't yeah, believe right. it. I mean, we have Glacial Valgory versus Divine Ascension, Ooh, I believe, right? Obsidian. Crazy. Obsidian. Ooh, Huge like name. Ooh, Huge that. balls by them. They're mm. going to go hard, I think. I think they might, uh, you know, we'll see what happens. Yeah. But you know, with that name like that, we like that. No, 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 no. That's the kind of stuff we like around here. We love seeing all these new faces, these yeah. new teams, new players. Yeah. It's new nearly every split. Some people would say lack of consistency. You know, I don't, I don't know who I'm going to support every split, but that's the best part right there. Right that is. is the best part. I was always told, keep life a mystery, and it will always keep people guessing. And that's what we like to do here at the that's SLS. Right. Uh, besides the script <laughs> that leaks every year, outside of that, it's a mystery. No, my, it's not my fault, of course. I would never do yeah. that. <laughs> we change right. the script every week, so it doesn't really matter. <laughs> not that I know of. That's what I'm saying. I get a playbook at the beginning of the season, and that's it. Well, you know, in classic SLS fashion, you know, we are running right on time, mm -hmm. perfectly ready to send you in to our incredible interviews we got lined up for you. We got two piping hot ones. We're going to serve up nice and fresh. Here we go. We are here today with JDK from Divine Ascension, Obsidian. This guy, I've seen him on the highlight reels. I've seen him out in the world you doing have. crazy stuff. Really? What a blessing to have him in the league today. It's an this, honor. He's the ADC for yeah. them. Uh, I mean, JDK, are you, I mean, tonight's the night. It starts up. What do you think? How are you feeling, man? Um, feeling okay. I think the team's feeling pretty confident right now. Uh, we've been putting in some decent work in, I think, the last few days, and I think it's been going well. That's huge. So that's good. I mean, it's it's the first game back of the season, right, to start it all off. So there's a lot of pressure on you and a lot. I know we have been talking how your name's been getting thrown around as someone to watch. So you're going to have the camera focused on you. Has your champion pool changed at all do you think you're still kind of the same have you grown as a player what's going on these days um i think it's definitely a level of trying to do stuff for like meta and like just seeing like what you can do but i think uh i've been sticking to the roots more especially after the swap and i think uh just sticking to like the main champs has been pretty good so far mm -hmm. fair enough i mean we're really at the end of the day we're all meta slaves anyway yeah <laughs> yeah uh, no doubt it sucks to be us. Damn. You know what That's I mean? It. But I think um, I'm ready to see some work from you in this game. Um, I, You know, do you like to run Flash? Do people still, you know, do you still run Flash? What do you do? You use Exhaust and Smite, right? Yeah. That's what, um, I you can't That's smite what I've been hearing. Anymore. You can't smite I definitely anymore. like, I'm, I'm, like, obviously Flash is great, but I feel like yeah. Ghost, been big Ghost abuser recently too. So yeah. just it's like running around the run map, around. ABCs are hard to catch. Fair. See, that's how we know you have 200 IQ. That's why we brought you on here. Because there's a lot of people that still use Flash these days. Not us. We go no summoner spells. Exactly. That's right. That's right. Unbound, keys. Unbound yeah. keys. Unbound keys. <laughs> that's exactly. right. I don't even use a keyboard anymore. Nope. Or What's mouse. What's no, point? that's it. Play that one. <laughs> go straight AFK. Just play Tap the monitor. It's not even touch screen. Yeah, yeah whatever. Exactly. So, JDK, thanks so much for joining us, man. Good luck in your match. You know, I have some faith in you from what I've been seeing. Awesome. Thank you so guys so much for having me. All right. Thank All right. You. See you. Take it easy. So today we have Nico Pay from Glacial Valkyrie. Nico Pay, can you tell me what role you play? What do you I play? I play support. Okay. So what are champions are you thinking are crazy right now? Don't, you know, don't reveal your lineup necessarily, but tell me some, what do you think is impressive to you at the moment? I mean, I'm finding a lot of success with like Karma, Zyra, um, Senna, those type of like enchanter 
champions. Nice. You'll do the damage to the uh, enemy lane. Yeah. 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 So you're That's like a, uh, you're literally a Draven's worst nightmare by the champions you play. No kidding. No kidding. Uh, does, does that mean ADC play Draven or something? What do you mention that? Uh, this uh, this uh, guy's uh, just obsessed no, 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 with Draven. Not, he's he's wishing it into existence. Yeah, he's wishing it into existence. Hold yeah, on, yeah, yeah. Ignore that. Ignore he that. wants to see Draven. Yeah. yeah. He just loves Draven. Yeah, he's a good champ. Don't okay. Know. All right, but you know, we love seeing you in the league here. How long have you been with your team? What do you think you have some strengths are of your team? What are some things you guys could improve on? Um, we've been together for about four or five months but the roster is kind of it's had a few switch outs and we're working out the kinks to it for sure um consistency is something that we're really working on with our team it's either we're really good or we're doing we're having a hard time catching up so um just keeping consistent macro is something we're really working on Smart. i mean it's Depending. tough it's, yeah, it's definitely tough league of legends is one of those games where nothing <laughs> is the same so you could run the same champion every single time, and it's a different outcome, which is incredible. Yeah. But a lot of people that we've seen here on the SLS are teams that, listen, they get destroyed in the early game, and all of a sudden mm -hmm. the game's gone 40 minutes, and they can find a way back in. Mm -hmm. yeah. So um, it's sometimes that's how it is. Scrappy play is not bad play. That's what we always say that's right. over here. That's right. Not uh, usually. No, not usually. Oh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this is true. This is true. And then, Nico, I have one final question before you guys get into your match here. Hmm. So I see those sticky notes on the wall. You don't need to share necessarily oh. if it's, you know, yeah, was, but yeah. what is that? I thought it was um, like a SOS or something. Up there. Um, <laughs> I was learning a language a while ago, so oh. I put all the words to it around my room. Oh, that's cool. Wait, oh that's smart yeah. as Wait, fuck. Wait, what, what, what language? That's a German? German? It was German. How'd you guess? I that? don't know. Okay, <laughs> you, I don't know what. How'd yeah. you guess? I don't that? know. What's but wrong with you? That's six. I'm surprised you noticed that though. Uh, yeah, yeah. No, I. I that's a good that idea. Good. You like good. wake yeah. up. I mean, you would you would see it anytime you're I in mean, the room. I mean, surrounded by it every day. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. yeah. I mean, Duolingo yeah. or Babbel is also a very good way to learn it's another true. language. True. Yeah. 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 But the sticky notes, old school. I like it. Yeah, for real. Thanks. Cool. All right, Nico Pay. Good luck in your game tonight. We want to see some performance. Ah, uh, good luck. Thanks. We need it. <laughs> okay, bye guys. Bye. She said, she said we need it. Yeah. I believe. I know. I believe that pick. too. I think so too. Yeah, yeah. Wait, this is the pick ban. Who, who's ban? So we got Nico ban. Ooh, Nico. Nico. Yep. Nico. Yep, Nico. Yep, yep, yep. Malkai. Hecarim. Hecarim. Zach. Uh, Nafari. She's sick. Yeah. Not, no, she's terrible. I hate that. Thing. Uh, Get depends, that thing out of the game. It depends on what you play. It's yeah. either bad or good. And then a Kali ban. <laughs> Uh, and we have immediately three picks on both sides. J4, Nyla, Ezreal, Vi, Zyra, and Sona mm, wow. out here. So coming up very strong with some juicy picks right here. The other the other bands coming out as Irelia, Silas, Orn, and Nar. So something that you're kind of worried about. The top lane, they knew they have to pick something, so they banded out right there. Volleybear ends up coming over. On that side, Dude, you uh, blink and it's over. I, Holy yeah, smokes. I mean, they're playing. They yeah, they're I mean, this tonight. is rapid fire. This is rapid wow. fire. They know what the heart wants. Um, so Nyla, one of these champions, I cannot stand. It's my most banned champion of all time. If, if I ever play a game, Nyla's banned. You like all the ads that she's. I, I I hate her. I actually <laughs> cannot stand her. She is, by my means, the most broken champion of all time. Uh, she has a nobody can touch you ability. Yep. She gets. Uh, I remember back in the day when they made Mordekaiser be able to get full experience, and they said that was too broken. We need to get rid of that. Yeah, and they brought. Then it they back. brought it back to another <laughs> champion, and, which was insane. And then gave her a Jax counter, and so she three, can't be hit. Yeah, for uh, last hit help. Uh, I, it's, I don't even tell me. I don't even know what the champion does. Don't want to know what it does uh, because she's banned every <laughs> time yeah, I've ever played. Play. You won't see no, I, I, there are hundreds of games. I've never seen her. I've never seen her in my life. Uh, but very strong comps coming out from both sides. A lot of damage. A lot of damage. A little more aggressive than you get in the early game with the Zyra Ezreal combo. Mm -hmm. You can just have a lot of poke right there. Zyra's just one of those champions that notoriously is annoying. The Volibear in the top lane, yep. too, you know, like very aggressive. Level 3 Volibear, man. What got, what yeah. can't that guy kill? I, I know, unless you're Poppy. A lot of playmaking, too, <laughs> yeah. on 
that side as well. You know, I'm really liking the team uh, yeah. so far with, the, you know, the J4, the R, you got mm -hmm. good engage options. That being said, you still have the Vi, you still have the Lux, you know. It's like both teams are very strong. They got their weaknesses and, you know, their I strong know. points. How okay. many times have we said it here? Listen, we love this comp coming up on one side, and then they just get obliterated coming over here. But if you were to put all the pieces together, it's like, how could you lose type thing? So there's on just, paper. there's yeah, there's just so many yeah. factors go up. One of the big things that stands out to me right now is Poppy is actually running Teleport, where Volley Bear is running Ignite. So you might try to see some early game kill potential coming off right here, or some sort of he might be pushing pretty hard. Wants this one v two scenario right here, and uh, oh, Ezreal uh -oh. finds out just in time that all five members have just shown up. Yeah, you know, there's a little bit of level one action going on there, but nothing going to come of that yet. One team playing a little bit more coordinated, the other team is playing really safe. It looks like J4 is going to be going for that counter invade, and I don't know, maybe they're expecting this. Uh -oh. They have everything scouted out Poppy's here. On the way. Yeah, here comes little Popster. They have the vision, and you know, honestly, level one advantage probably goes to the blue side here. You know, they got the ward down. The other side did not get any wards in the enemy jungle, so you know, not too bad of a start so far. No, not at all. I mean, J four is just one of those champions that you kind of see. He's just so good from early game, mid game, late game. Uh, just an incredible champion for the most part. Vi is actually one of those people that you can actually just see just kind of take over a match sometimes. Mm -hmm. um, it's like, what happened? She got two, three, four kills, and all of a sudden she can do whatever she wants. But I think we got a little interaction over here in the top lane. Volley Bear choosing to just throw the E down. That's and yeah, it, it, no, I mean, it's, it's max HP damage. So oh, that's the no, thing. No. It's, it's AP plus max HP. So... If you're ever in that way, just get out of it immediately. But Poppy also with max damage on her Q2 as well. Mm -hmm. So it's just a, a lot of matchup, yeah, it's a lot of max damage going on over here in the top lane. So that's always juicy. Um, junglers starting opposite sides. So we're not going to see him path the same way at this point, right? You're most likely going to see something on top, something on bot lane, maybe even in the mid lane because of the, the ward pressure that you got over here. You know that one side's kind of clean. So you might see that, but it's it's interesting. I kind of like I kind of like the reverse start over here because you had the authority to ward the, their red. So you go, listen, you I, know I, what yeah, she's gonna do. I there. know that I know that she's starting this side, so it opens up a little avenue for you. And actually, does it skip the Rafters camp? J four did, and he just went straight to the red buff. So why is going back yeah. to her red? So we might just see. J4 make his presence known a little bit earlier on the map than Vi right now, which is which could be huge. If Zyra can land, uh, you know, a nice little route for that J4. Yeah, I think it might be first. Yeah, run. and here he goes. Or he's coming. He's coming straight to the bot lane. So this is kind of what I figured was going on right here. He's got less than half his health, so oh. the combination has to work here. He just dies right now. Uh, oh, so J4 that. is going in on the bot lane oh, right now. Here he goes. First blood first goes blood. over to the bottom yeah. there. That is beautiful right right now. The exhaust dropped down. A lot of damage going both on both sides. J4 gets exhausted too, but he doesn't actually die. He gets out of there right now. Nobody is oh, going down. Oh, oh, there man. it is. The flash. Gotta the use flash. It, gotta use it. Wow, so that's all sums on the side of DA Obsidian. That's, that's the press the attack damage right there is what that is. Nasty. That's the difference. Yeah, but all summoners gone down um, except for Ezreal's flash. Mm -hmm. He actually remained, he managed to keep that right here. And uh, like we had talked about a little bit earlier, Volley Bear with that early game pressure is able to pick up that kill right at level three with the Ignite going on his side. Poppy able to TP back and immediately pick up a level four. So not total no, loss. Not horrible for the Poppy. Yeah, and that's the worst part. It's like, what do you mean I killed this person in lane and now they're a level ahead of me? Right. Sometimes the wave just works out like that and it sucks. I see Ari doing some last hitting here too. She's at five. I think she wants to do something to Lux, but I don't know when she's going to do it necessarily. Five farm down, not too bad early. Well, Lux these days is... Oh, I mean, look at this. Yeah, that's a lot of damage. There's a huge amount of damage shit. coming in. And that, you know, that is the Volla Bear, like, action right there. The early game. Poppy cannot stand up to that. The thunder damage coming through big time. Yeah, it, 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 the bear. The bear's just too powerful, right? And he's just going to stack this demolish thing to get a plate here in a second. It looks like 
Uh, Be a little careful. Probably, yeah, probably right? trying to do. Oh, oh my, my God, he's going even, for it. He did matter. it. He did it. He oh, dies, God. though. I Trades, mean, but you know, the whole wave dies under tower. Wave's in a good spot. A really good trade by the Volibear. And, you know, just extending his lead even further. Yeah, which is kind of nice. I mean, Lux, I think, is probably the safest pick in the game right now. Uh, it's Lux, up there. Is, Lux is ultimate plus just an E can clear an entire wave, mm. which is which is incredible. Um, and right here we see Rave Master snuck in here. Uh, they have no idea that Vi is here right now, so I'm sure they want to get caught out by some sort of ability or oh something. My. Zyra oh, gets a drop down on her, and is it going to be enough? Just barely. Oh, oh running up here. Wait, no, she tries over a kill. Oh, oh, no, what what is down. happening? Double kill. What it is, is going that? to be a triple kill. Oh, yes, no. it is. A disaster Yo. strikes. Ezreal picking up the triple oh, kill and a God. massive gold swing. That coming is in. a PayPal investigation that right, is there. right there. I'll tell you that right now. That is exactly what that is. That really. Really tragic end what right there. What just happened? And here we go. Mid lane, oh, Lux not going to be able to survive this next domino falling. Yeah, the auto attack Q from the J4, up. and there it is. Another kill going Oh, over. my God. That is a disaster in the bot lane. I don't, I, I mean, it, I get, right? It's frustrating over here. Oh, okay, Volibear it disables the turret. The ignite is not going to be enough. Knows that tower strikes coming in here. Drops in. Oh, I'm scared. Just but missed. Poppy doesn't, yeah, I feel like I doesn't know the timing. Just missed. But yeah, seriously, bot lane, what a mess right that here. That was not it's, good. It's very mm -hmm. unfortunate that the Zyra survives, right? I get it. Like, listen, I don't care if I die. I just want to get the Zyra kill. But apparently everybody had that mentality, and every person dropped. The, the, the Vi drops, the Nyla drops, the Sona drops. I mean, it was rough to watch right there. And that is not something you want to do is you want to give Ezreal a four-kill lead right now i mean that guy i mean what's he gonna, he just needs to farm now he, he can keep going if he yeah, wants to hit those cues uh, early game i mean this guy's doing what's he got he's got the call in the tier he'll build the tier early but next back i mean those cues are gonna be doing 200 250 damage a pop to easy. the champions i mean that's that's a lot i mean ezreal's one of those champions that like you'll you'll start to see it towards like the the mid-ish game right here where all of a sudden he's firing out those three second cues and they all do 300 damage Scary. each hit it's it's not a fun ride for you if you're on the receiving end, especially when he gets his uh, uh, Sorelia's grudge, the the slow. Yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, especially oh, once he gets that, it just sucks for you. I mean, that guy. It's can not a good whatever. time. You can try to say, listen, we have a vi, we can do whatever we want. J4 is uh, here. Yeah, the vision drops down over here, but it looks like they still want to go for it right here. They're oh, lining up. Sona taking a lot of damage immediately. Ezreal. Oh, oh does not get the flawless kill, tower dive that. right there. Yeah. Double kill coming in. Zyra, Zyra picking up both of them. And, you know, this game is all but over at this point. That's that's tough early game. Yeah, I mean, nine and one at I don't minutes. know if it was coincidental or they said, listen, they still got like 20 seconds left on their flash so they can't escape. Mm. I'm going to go with the latter and say they knew that their flash wasn't up for another 20 seconds, so let's dive them. And uh, very well played over here. We're seeing a dominant, dominant game right here. Oh, they, they do lose the Rift Herald, so actually they suck. Oh, no. <laughs> a small consolation, but still 4K gold at eight minutes in. You don't see that too often in League these days. No, you don't. And, you know, this game, you know, what can you do if you're the side of Obsidian? How can you get yourself back into this game? That is the real question. We might not even have the answer to that. The amount of gold you are behind is just so substantial. I don't even know how you even find a way out of this game. They're going to... I Listen, so they are behind right now. Sona 0-3. Um, who is that? Who is their... No, Obsidian's bot lane ABC. Who is that with the whip? The whip? That is Nyla. Nyla. A little Nyla. You know, maybe we find some plays onto the Nyla, but, you know, it's, it's tough. You know, there's... Really, just not too many avenues to get back into this one. It just doesn't get any easier with the game progressing. And Vi comes down, can't do anything. Meanwhile, Nyla is taken below 20% HP with ease from the poke from these two champions in the bot lane, Zyra and Ezreal. Nyla is crying. Vi sticking around, seeing what she can do to help these guys out. But 
Ari is also on her way down. And J4. By alt, the Ezreal, or no, I'm sorry, the Zyra, she gets away with the Flash, but big damage. Zona goes down, misses the charm from Ooh. the Flash on the Nyla. She still goes down. The damage just isn't oh, there. Just Here done. comes J4, That's finishing tough. it off a double kill, Holy more shit. gold. It is just an absolute bloodbath, and they are going to be walking home with this one. <laughs> and Ezreal shows a little bit off there, hits these Lux across the map, says, hey, well, you're not safe either. I'm going to hit you with this. Um, after a full cleanup of bot lane, that was Vi, uh, Nyla, and Sona all dead for nothing on the side of Glacial Valkyrie. So they're doing some work with these guys right now. No, this Ezreal sure. Zyra bot lane is popping. Uh, they're popping the fuck off yeah, right well, now, to be honest with you. Poor, poor Valley Bear right here. He's, like well, <laughs> you know, he was in that jungle. He does have double that CS still, which is pretty clean. He did want to see what he could do in that for that red buff. What is, I mean, what's Nyla doing? She's hitting the, the splash. She's got AoE on the auto attacks. Yeah. Wow. She can whip them. I kind of like that. Terrible. Caterpillar for now. Terrible. That means butterfly uh, the, the, the soon. Best, the best thing I can say of why I ban Nyla all the time, outside of all the reasons I already listed, is in one of our games... There was a Graves that somehow managed to go 19 and 2. This is you. And lost to a Nyla that had four kills and like 60 CS. Oh my God. Because he can't hurt her. He can't damage her. Uh, yeah, but anyways, this is a bloodbath right here, right oh, now. Both great. exhausts going out immediately. J4 going to pick up a nice kill on Sona right here. Ezreal doing a ton of damage over to Nyla at this point. I mean, I don't know what it goes through your head right now when it's 14 and 2 I mean the only thing you can kind of say to yourself is listen we got a Rift Herald right uh, that's it <laughs> and we killed we killed really Bully not. Bear twice that's good for <laughs> one them. of the time he died in the jungle the other time he died to a turret uh, so he's picking away at this turret speaking of in the top lane right now Poppy is not really able to do anything at this point knows it and the help is just not there for any lane. I mean, it's frustrating, right? Uh, you go bot lane, you, you, you go 3v2 over here, you die. It's, it sucks. It was, it was a rough one. Then you get, a, I guess, a lucky pick with Bola Bear going through your jungle and you have three people right. that just rotate over here. They appreciate Out, it. Yeah. For, it's like a gift from him. Yeah, outside of that, nothing has happened. Nothing. There has been no magic worked on Obsidian side that we've seen whatsoever. All right. We do see a little bit of work from the Vi. She wants. Uh, well, actually, that might be left over. But she's in the jungle with with J4 and Ezreal. She's. I think she wants to run away, which I really can't blame her. Um, but that dragon did go over to Glacial Valkyrie right there. Vi needs to, I mean, I don't know. They all need to do something. The bot lane 0 and 9, I don't know what I'm supposed to do. What are you supposed to do exactly? You know what I mean? And I mean, really, at the end of the day, there's just not a lot to comment on this, you know. One team is a massive advantage. Here comes Zyra up to the top lane. Baller almost for sure going to pick up this kill. No mana on to the poppy. Dead. Another kill. Is he even worth anything at this point? Only time Maybe. will tell. Uh, who knows? But it's Maybe. just not a good situation. <laughs> oh. Okay. Who's yeah. Who's there? I think someone almost broke into our house here. I, we're, you know, we're just trying to have a peaceful broadcast. Someone almost tried to attack us, I think. But we have a security system in place. I think they've been vaporized. We should be good. That yeah. Power is down. Bolly Bear is done. He's done with the lane. Yeah, that's a that's a, some beautiful solo gold over hit for here right now. So, uh, Josh, I'm gonna hand I'm gonna hand it over to you right now. Oh, sorry, 450 what? damage combo from Ezreal is nasty on the. What side. do you do right now? You're red team. What do you do? Okay, so am I them in this game? Or yeah, yeah, yeah. Am yeah, I yeah. them in solo? You're, team? you're you're an absolute whole team. You're not an individual player. All right, so. FF, right, FF is not <laughs> in the playing cards. At the nope, moment. nope, nope. So what do I tell them to do? Right now we have an 0-9 bot. You know, what can standard. y'all really do? Just Standard. Right, it is standard. Yeah, Unless so that's there. that's what you're used to already. <laughs> what else do you just, do? You know, get some minions. I mean, try to try to go for OBJs you see that these guys are not <laughs> on or attached to, which is going to be very rare. Uh, it's tough. 
I don't know really if I have any advice at all. I don't know if I'm uh, qualified to provide advice that is this doomed. Yeah, so here's one thing, actually another thing that, uh, oh my god. I was going to dive into the tower. Yeah. Full ultimate. He's They're going to give away some kills. What I don't was, know about that, that play. That was a little wild, but whatever. Shut you down for shutdown, yeah. Oh, why, wait, I... why get yourself killed? Wait, now they got kills in the bot killed. lane, too. Wait a second. They just made big money moves to get themselves back into the game here. Yeah. Wait a minute. Your answer should have been, um, but they have a Nyla. That yeah. should have been your answer. Actually, you know what? what you said, yeah. that's very true. So far, you know, that seems to be the prophecy right now. They might not be out of this game yet with the Nyla yeah. in their possession. That's it. So what I always recommend out here, and uh, RuneScape taught me this way back in the day, is what I call the death brush. Oh. And it's where all five members, sometimes four members, of your team sit in one brush that you know is not warded. That's a high traffic area. Guaranteed kill. Guaranteed kill, and it can sway the things. Now it's a four on four or five on four, whatever you want to do. It's beautiful. That might be a good idea right now. Yeah. Mm. I know Poppy might not be able to make it to the party. Vi's coming in. Oh, and boy. Big money. Volibear wants this fight. He wants to take the Poppy down 1v3, oh, but it's not going to be enough. The dancing comes in. The Sona ult. The Lux ult for good measure. A 4v1. Volibear can't quite pull that off. He's it's not over. that fed. He tried. He, he tried. tried. He but tried. I think Obsidian needs to look for things like that where they have a clear advantage because, of course, I mean, a 1v1, you're going to die right now. Oh, yeah. No matter who you're against. There's no doubt. You're going to die. You get get three people on one. Try it out. You have a dragon up in a 50 seconds. I don't know what they're going to go mm. for here. They want to try to contest it, of course, but it's a team fight is scary. Yeah, I, I think Obsidian is doing the good job of, hey, listen, Poppy, you can't win a 1v1. Hey, Poppy, Vi, I'm not even sure if you can win a 2v1. Hey, Sona Vi Poppy, I don't know if you can win a 3v1, so let's send a fourth member up there, use all four ultimates, and we got a real shock. You, so that's what you're looking at right now. You know, at the end of the day, you're probably attacking the weakest <laughs> member on the team, just as far as, like, stat gold-wise, you know. Yeah. Follow Bear a little bit behind compared to his counterparts who are extremely ahead. So, you know, just get a little bit of gold back in your pocket. Never a bad thing. But that being said, Obsidian still has a long way to go. That is 10k down that's been that way for the last two minutes. So I guess, you know, it hasn't gotten any worse. I guess that's a positive. And here's what I was talking about earlier. Oh. Lux can just clear anything with her ultimate... Uh, plus one other ability, the wave's gone. Mm. So in terms of, hey, we want to push mid lane, we want to push bot lane, we want to push top lane, whatever it is that you decide is a unit to push, Lux can essentially stop that with one to two abilities. And then all it's already almost back from Lux too. It's, I mean, yeah. 75% of the way. Right, which is crazy. So it's, it's, almost like a, it's almost like a game plank in a way of no matter, no matter how many kills we have above you, if there's a game plank on the enemy team, we can't push to end the game. <laughs> as long as he's alive, you can never push to end the game. And it's just crazy. That man can solo carry and push any game out to 40 minutes. I infinitely. Infinitely. Just with the barrels combo, it's not possible to lose. Uh, I remember Lux used to be like that. Like, I want to say pretty early in the seasons when the Fiends was still a thing. Yeah. AP still still like it now with her all. It's kind of getting back in favor here. It. But Oh, wow. Big damage. Big damage, oh, big God. team fight. Vi coming in, trying to pick Holy. a kill off the backside. But is this going to be enough? Nyla goes in, tries to clean up, and Poppy's on the backside as well. It looks like this fight might have gone the way of Obsidian. Poppy still in there, tanking it up. The J4, J4 looking for a pick around. on the backside. But Poppy finds a shutdown onto the Ari, and this fight goes extremely wrong for Glacial. They try to look for a fight to end the game, but it looks like Obsidian is not dead yet. That was a three-man Lux ult. Yeah. Which, I mean, huge. that shit did 500 damage a pop to those guys. As soon as that happened, I think they got the disadvantage. J4 manages to make it out with less than 15% health. I mean, what a good man who got out of there. But that is tough. That is very to tough. To see. Yeah. Um, for Glacial right now, they should, that should not be happening. And you know, that no. uh, we're getting down to 8K gold. You know, it's going in the wrong direction. And... You know, that team, it does scale. You know, the Lux scales. You got to say, you got to look at the Nile at his, and it's scaling. Ezreal and Ari both, like, very mid-game spiking. Kind of falls off. Volibear definitely falls off. If you reach late game, how are you killing that Poppy? You know, they're kind of mm -hmm. almost on a bit of a timer right now. They got to kind of get their act together and look to close this one out. Yeah, the timer keeps getting extended for every tower you have, right? I mean, they've only taken one tower this whole game. They're three dragons behind. They're a Rift Herald yeah. behind. So the problem is, listen... 
we get we do great in these team fights right we just saw this right here they obviously have the composition to make things work mm -hmm. for them if they engage in an improper way now what do you do oh i can take one tower okay now we now we have to win another fight like that i can take one more tower and and that's where the issue is uh oh and you see stuff like that. and then you throw it all away right. and there it goes right there <laughs> yeah, that, you know that's it. Yeah. you try to walk in something you think is your territory but no at this right point in the arrow. game unless you're a full five stack you are got to be careful where you are walking that's going to be a free baron going over unless there is a steal possibility Vi is definitely a champ that has potential to steal a baron poppy mm -hmm. as well can knock away the jungler they have the team to do it but volver is trying to sniff this one out goes for the push mm -hmm. top lane they might be looking for something here there is a chance of a steal there is always a chance of a steal poppy in wow. interestingly goes for the volibear oh, top Look at trying to get a here it is kill. baby here it is close the wall too soon but they keep damaging it it's gonna be oh Yay! my god the steal they coin flip it Andy. they don't stop dpsing oh. he doesn't get out but that is going to be objective bounty baron coming over baron on three four. or four I people four was the lux alive the lux uh, was not alive the lux was not alive, alive. Yep. but still three people with the baron that's huge they're going to you idiot! And uh, a massive team oh my fight God. breaks out yeah, right whoa. here. But you and didn't get to see not it. Breaking out. Thank right God here. for that. Thank God for that. My eardrums are doomed. <laughs> Holy crap! I'm sorry, everyone at home. In case you did not know, this is the Swag Life series. That's what we're just trying to represent on one more time. Right. Yeah. Your toes for that stuff. We've got a new intern who's neurologically divergent. Um, we're, in we, equal, we're, we're we're very equal opportunities nope. around here. <laughs> oh, no. What is going on? He's a uh, <laughs> He's stimming out a little bit on us here. This is, but you know we love him. We love that little He's scam. That's it. The scuttle crab does go down for those that are wondering at home what is going on right there, and that's a full recall coming over for the jar. Yeah, but... um, I would have loved to see any of that, but you know, yeah, we got some nice transitions. At least you can appreciate that part. Yeah, it of does. Our production. I mean, when you put the budget into transitions like that, you yeah. want people to see what it is. Sometimes just after a game is not enough. I won in between games, during games, and luckily my Actually, anonymous request. You know what? My attention. Actually, you know what? Hit me one time. Yeah, give it. Hit to me us one, one time. time. Give me one more. I need. I need that again in my life. Right now. We're transitioning. Yeah, baby. <laughs> there it Woo is. Woohoo! Take your Boom. gaming to the next level, baby. I Take know. it. Even that is though huge. our graphic on screen does say that this is the SLS 2022, our our <laughs> yeah. registration. And maybe for we said that all year. Our registration for next split is currently open. Yeah, you know, maybe join.sls.lol. Some, some might argue we've never had one that says 2023. <laughs> some may argue that, but you know. Some say we live in the past, but I live on a new future. So technically, it's always a year behind. That's true. Let's so, think about cars. All of the yeah, exactly. This is all pre-recorded a whole year ago. Yep. Uh, so that's why you're seeing this right now. We got an objective bounty claimed by the little popster, and oh, it looks like they're giving up this soul. They find the buy this time. No shenanigans. That's going to be cloud soul going over. Yeah, nothing nice worse, and easy. Nothing worse as a jungler Ooh. than uh, you go like, I can steal it. I just stole the other one, and then you just get gang. All right, little <laughs> little like four members. Little pop star's got a bear after him. But here come the boys, Nyla and Sona. Not exactly boys, but they're coming in hot. Bubble bear in trouble. Gonna get that shield. Boom. Gonna try to fight. Huge damage. Nyla kind of walks into it, but it doesn't matter. The damage is gonna oh, be too much. No. Bubble bear gets the black. Going, and he gets out yes he does a misplay for sure they're pushing into the base they're gonna get two towers for this I, I mean i always say if you can try to get a kill go for it who cares that's what that's what i've always oh here said. comes poppy nyla sona we've got Vi coming in just respawned they can't get this inhibitor maybe they can they're gonna be backing off so they do manage to save the inhibitor to prevent more snowballing on the map but a bit of a miss execute there by Obsidian. Kind of had an avenue back into that. Get some gold. But Volibear managing to escape with his life. Yeah, it's the, the good old blast going right there. He gets him out every single time. I I, I mean, it, it's just not worth it from the get-go. <laughs> I mean, you know they're doing Dragon, right? Your, your jungler just died uh, attempting to steal it, and the whole team turned on him. So... Listen, there's there's one option. They're not going all the way to top lane to, to help the Volibear at this point. So just recall, uh, save at least one tower. You, you'll probably oh lose my. one of them. But uh, that's... Oh, that knock uh, up on the edge rough. from the Xylalt. And wow, Volley gets caught by the Lux Q and it completely finishes off their push there. 
And what I think is interesting as well, you have a roughly 6k gold difference here, despite a 24 to 7 kill. But, yeah, and you know, and, I mean, yeah, and, and, wow. and that's the objective bounty is really coming to a show right there. I like that. Yeah, it's really huge. And you know, the gold has only been shrinking, so this is only getting better and better for Obsidian. They might actually have an avenue back into this one that being said the inhibitor falls if they screw up here this could easily be the game j4 getting some poke down they are looking they're posturing to try to end this game um no other ways push again though this might not be the best macro decision for them they try to get this inhibitor but there's no minions backing that up lux push that wave out for full and but that being said, Lux is not here for this fight. They're going to let the inhibitor fall and maybe look for a fight here. The ultimate comes in by going in backline onto the Ezreal, but cannot find him. And this might be an absolute disaster. Ezreal free hitting on the back. J4 getting the engage and the ultimate comes in onto the Lux. And this fight is going from bad to worse. Nala trying her best, getting some kills, but doesn't matter. It's going to be end of the game. And just like that, looks like Glacial will finish this one off after they pick up the minion wave. Yeah, that's it. I, I, I Plain and simple right here. I mean, Vi thought that she had something uh, of, listen, I have a pickoff right here, but he's so far in the back of the line with a flash, with an E. Uh, there's just nothing the team can do to follow up right there. So you, you immediately just concave your whole team and you die. I mean, I get it, right? There's, there's not too many options you have at this point. Uh, it was either make some sort of move, fight, or just let your turrets fall and try to fight during that. Either way, I think the outcome would have been the same. And you know what's funny? We saw Nico pay on Zyra. She mentioned she was going to play Zyra. Glacial Valkyrie. Oh, uh, you know, good luck. Oh, we need it. 9, 2, and 10 in the lane. The bot lane carrying the game, arguably. A huge start from uh, Glacial Valkyrie doing yeah. that for themselves. Uh, a little bit of a waver in the mid game, but nothing to worry about yeah, toward the end. They go right in and they finish it off. When you're that far ahead, you know, you, you got you you some time to play with in. your food. You yeah. make a couple mistakes. You have so much gold in your pocket, so much, so many objectives on the map. The dragons, they stacked every dragon in the game. They they lost the Baron, you know, slight hiccup just delayed the game a little bit longer. They gave us more entertainment. We have appreciate some fun. that. Exactly. We appreciate more that. More content. I, I mean, go. yeah, it's, it's, this is leaked, remember? Yes. This That's is right. Leaked. Anything can happen. Whoa. Wow. We got a we got an interview coming yeah, up? Yeah, I think we do. I we think got an we interview do. coming up. New format. Interesting. No I deal. was not informed of this. I this thought is, we were going uh, to take a little break, cool, but actually. we got I a bit of a like Yeah, that. this is this is awesome. More interviews are always better. We've said that the whole time. You know, we love yeah. getting to know our players. Um and uh, yeah, you know, new team, new players, it's it's fantastic. Yeah, I you can never go you can never go wrong with it. I think we're actually just ready we're just good to oh, go yeah, we're right good. we're not ready we're not ready we're not ready, I'm not ready. Not, i'm sorry we're, we're really not ready. ready we're not ready. it's uh anytime we say we're ready it's like a give or take five minutes maybe <laughs> ten. And, and give, or, <laughs> give or take that another 15 honestly yeah you can always add another 15 to sometimes it, i get the day wrong. you don't have to yeah exactly um so for, for a little trivia for those who didn't know sls was supposed to be every tuesday uh, and somehow they got lost in translation. It, it, it honestly, that bad. Well, fun yeah. fact, it still is. That's just how not on time yeah, we exactly. are. Yeah, exactly. I mean, that's a, it's a, a two-day delay. Um, yeah, and you know, time zones. To, that seems to work for us. And that's just time yeah, zones I mean, right we there, all show you know, up at the yeah. same time despite that. Right. So it's very interesting. We might have, like, a connection or something like that. You would think, which is very yeah, nice. I think I hear, think so. I hear someone on the line. Is that uh, BLG... Uh, Peekaboo there. Is that that guy? Yep, that is Here me. We go. Hey, there he is. This is the guy who wrote an amazing article, I think, on the power rankings of the team in our league this split, which, I mean, Ooh. fantastic by you. I read it. I mean, I love hearing the analysis from an outside party as well because it's so in-depth, and I feel like I love to see it from people who don't necessarily have a piece of the production. Like, we're you know, we're... I'll, I'll, I love reading it. Thank you so much for yeah, the POV. That's, that's, that's what I'm trying to say. Yeah. Oh my God. So, Peekaboo, you saw what Glacial Valkyrie is doing. You're about to face these guys, right? What do you think about yep. this? What do you think? What do you think? What are, you, what are the thoughts going through your head after that game? I mean, they definitely look good. Uh, we just played against Void's team on Tuesday. So, we kind of know how good they are. Um, but this team definitely showed they were good. We're not too worried. Uh, we're pretty confident in ourselves. So, so that's always good. Not it's too worried. Good. That's half the battle. Confidence is key. Yeah, that's mm -hmm. what they say. Is knowing you can do it, feeling like you can do it. I think they could. 
I think they could I too. Think they could. I, I, from the whispers that go around the office. Oh my god! I think you got a real shot. This you remember year. that one last week? Oh yeah, that was oh crazy. that that no. one was crazy. I, oh illegal, illegal, right. but crazy. In most heard, states, in yeah, most states. Yeah, in most. Yeah, yeah. This is true. Um, but I, I mean, so far, like it's it's been exciting. That this is the first week back and everything like that. Um, so give us on a scale one to ten how excited you are and have been. I mean, we're pretty excited. This is our first league as a team. Uh, we've been itching to get in a league and just kind of prove ourselves. Um, so to finally get it after waiting a month here, we're ready to just prove ourselves and take some names. Oh my That's God. Right. That's Bada right. Bing. We like That's to see. That's a go in. Bada boom. Oh. I'd almost argue. <laughs> Let's go. So I don't know if you know the rule or not, but uh, as your first time as a team, you're supposed to buy all the casters a gift from Amazon. Um, so we'll get that memo sent out to you. And uh, I'm, I'm just the ADC. That's my support's job. Yeah. Oh, oh so really? Really? Okay. That's, that's, that's support's job, yeah. not mine. Dude, the yeah. support abuse today is real, man. <laughs> Every, yeah. Everyone, yeah. man. It's hey, he ends me. He has to do something. That's this true. true. That's this true. true. Grace okay. with your presence, you know. He's got to repay you somehow. <laughs> That's good. Well, you know, Peekaboo, thank you so much for joining us. Uh, we cannot wait to see you out there. Go out there and dominate that bot lane. Piece of cake. Let's Piece go. of cake. My team right. might hit me, so if they don't hit, I mean, we got this. It's always it's team perfect. death. Always That's team right. death. Right. Good luck out there. Thank you. All right. Take it easy. See ya. Thank you. Yeah. Good stuff. He's good. Very and, good stuff. Again, that guy wrote an article about the power rankings for the teams currently in this league. It is That's in cool. chat at the moment. Yeah. And so locally for us, we have a team from UMass Amherst Ooh. in the league this split, which That's is pretty exciting. We've been trying for something like this. We had one from California. Remember Cal Poly last split, but something local like this, UMass Amherst, you guys might see something involving those guys. You know, a little bit later in the split. So and you know, you know, it could be something cool for here us. at the SLS. You know, we've only provided you with a two sense experience. You know, the the sense of sight, sense of sound. You know, but now with these oh, live players, minute, that's about, all five senses. As long as we depict what, what they about are. What the sense of smell? You <laughs> for you sense of smell. Oh well, that's a whole nother thing. <laughs> that is a whole nother thing. All right, but we're but see now we have the opportunity to get yeah. every single sense. We're gonna tell you how they the touch you mm -hmm. know how they feel and they're gonna and, let us live in their dorm room for a month and of course so the we can get a full experience <laughs> yeah. yeah feel smell taste possibly you know i'll you be tasting stick all of yeah that's what yeah, i'm saying yeah, yeah, yeah that's it's all fair game it, this is true this is true um so it's gonna be kind of crazy we'll probably do a live stream of one of the college parties they were at. Yeah, I know. Um, and we're going to tear it up. Yeah. And I, I, actually, I think we're going to go tear it up right now. we got to take a quick break, refuel, recharge, get you guys ready for the next one. Stay tuned. Don't go anywhere. Pop the popcorn, man. Pop it up.